Get ready to time travel. And go. Here I am in Paris, France. Sup, Eiffel Tower. I write a love letter here and I give it to a stranger. That stranger may read it now or later. Whenever they do read it, my moment in time will sit in their hands. And in their heads, they're with me as I wrote it, word by word, inside my mind. When they read it again later, the moment they see my words, they can transport back to the first time. And now, the Eiffel Tower means something different than it did before the letter. So every time you read this letter, you time travel. And every time you see an image of where you were when you read it, you time travel. And so can I. Because I will know that somewhere out there is that human with a piece of my heart in their hand. My mind can imagine them holding my love throughout their day, their week, their life. I wrote it then, you read it now, and now, and now, and here, and here. And it keeps going as long as we keep writing and we build a bridge with the superpower of words and the kindness of strangers. And the love, and the love, and the love, sharing joy that jolts your body into remembering how you are a part of a time-traveling team all over the earth. Your words have been found. They have traversed time. You've touched hearts. Love always in always. Read a letter. Write a letter. Join a revolution.